Excuse me. Sorry. Have I seen you before? No. I think I have. I never forget a beautiful woman. How's it going? He's good to go. What happened in your disguise? Genius in there thinks I'm more than a peasant. So when can we make our move on the tours? Any time. Like I said, he's good to go. Want to come out for a drink? Can't. Got to consummate the deal. Oh, you're heartless. It's my job. I know it sounds ridiculous, but I didn't. I just made sure my door was locked. What time did the attack happen? I'm not exactly sure. I was on my way home from dinner last night when a woman pulled me into the shadows. She said it was my fault Lorelai died. What exactly did she say? She screamed. It's your fault Lorelai died. It's your fault. Do you have any idea as to who it might be? I didn't recognize the voice, and Lorelai never spoke about her friends, so I'm clueless. Not to mention frightened to death. Could it be another one of your clients? Absolutely not. None of them knew Lorelai, and none of them are that dangerous. This world sometimes. <laughs> well, Detective Sarah, I couldn't help but notice that your hand was shaking violently the other day. Prolonged and intense stress can precipitate formidable mental illness. Petros, stop bouncing. Does he ever stop? When he gets thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> He's growing up so fast. I understand. I know you do. Hands up! Oh my God, Petros, where did you get that? In Daddy's drawer. Petros, put it down. Please, just give it to me. It's good. Do as your mama says. Make love to me, Larry. Excuse me? Make love to me before you walk out of my life forever. Well, I guess we're consenting adults. I accept your rejection. <laughs>